do not fight do not try to hurt anybody for them to stay around you people should want to be around you freely Why are you still holding on to people who stated clear that they no longer want to be a part of your life? Um, if people want to go, man, you have to release them and let them go because everything is only for a season. Some people are in your life just for a season or for a reason. So when that um, particular season is over you have to let them go I know it might be easier said than done but what's the sense of trying to force somebody to stay or trying to hurt them it makes no sense um, you have to give people your blessing who oh, no grudge no hard feelings and just wish them well and let them go um i know sometimes the process it's very painful but this is life and do whatever you have to do to cope and to help you to get over your pain and trust and believe that in time you will look back on the whole situation and smile um people leave for all different kind of reasons and it's not in our control after you try everything that you you can and if that doesn't work then what else are you gonna do you have to forgive and move on rejection teach you how to forgive it teach you how to cope with all kind of stuff and you know what you grow and um, some of the time that is where you find your strength for everything that happened to you you know there is a lesson to be learned so take that lesson and um, use it for the betterment of yourself trust the process and trust the most high because He's never going to give you more than what you can bear. Um, sometime, he all the time, he has something better for you. But in order for you to receive that gift, you have to let go of this thing or this person that you've been holding on to. Um, yeah, man. So release people gracefully. Release them and let them go. Holding no hard feeling as i said before it is easier said than done but you can do it when it's when it's time to leave you just have to leave and most of the time to we are blocking our blessing by constantly complaining constantly um holding on to to the negative and not seeing the good in every situation and giving thanks for small mercies you know you know by giving thanks um it open a lot of doors and bring um new opportunities and new possibilities in your life so in the midst of your trial in the midst of you going to your heartache and your pain man there is something to give thanks about so you have to exercise faith and know that father if you um allow this thing to happen to me if you allow this person to believe in after all that i have invested my time my money my energy after all of that and they still want to go then i guess you must have something better in store for me yeah so you have to look on the on the positive all the time and just strength from that because Jehovah 
He's never gonna leave you nor forsake you, man. He will never do that. So, the moral of this whole thing is just to let people go when they wanna go. Do not fight, do not try to hurt anybody for them to stay around you. People should wanna be around you freely. Um, people should want to be around you freely, man. Just lean on Jehovah for healing. And he will heal you. And he will bring you out of this heartache and this pain and this rejection. Um, a better person. Yeah. You will find your joy. You will find your peace. And you will look back and say, my God, this is what I was holding on to. This is what I I I didn't want to let go. Um, there is always a lesson, and from the lesson you get your blessing. So, um, forgive and move on. Do not block your blessing by trying to hold on to people who wanna leave out of your life if people want to leave release them bless them and let them go